Bus drivers are being trained to take on new safety roles on autonomous vehicles as more driverless vehicles are expected to hit the roads. One of the country's biggest transport operators, Comfort Delgro, is putting its first batch of 11 drivers through a program to learn to monitor and control AVs. The government recently announced plans to roll out public AV buses in Pungol by the end of the year. Eugene Chow with more. Shafawi Zailani now works as a safety operator on autonomous buses within Ni'an Polytechnic, the only manpower needed in such vehicles. He's gone through four months of training, including theory and practical tests to be qualified. It's a big change for the 39-year-old who has been driving manual buses for about 20 years. Shafawi says he took on Comfort Delgro's upskilling program as he believes it will offer him more career options in future. There will be a lot of autonomous vehicles that we are going to learn. I mean, there's a level, which is level 1, level 2, level 3, or 2, up to level 5. And like currently now, we are safety driver, we are sitting inside the, inside the bus. So when, come, uh, when days goes by, we maybe will not sit inside the bus. We'll be maybe controlling outside the bus to control the vehicle. Comfort Delgro says the initiative will expand based on how the AV ecosystem and regulations evolve. To that end, it says its AV-related training and development are key to creating new roles for the next generation of mobility solutions. Comfort Delgro is now looking to grow its training programs so staff can work with different types of autonomous vehicle technology. It's also planning to create new roles such as remote operators, maintenance crew and data analysts. Still, the firm noted that traditional drivers are still needed to keep the transport system sustainable, even as new technologies emerge. Another operator, Go Ahead Singapore, says while it is not conducting any AV training yet, it is open to supporting future initiatives.